How's it going guys? Ghost of Bones here, and today is the first update for my cosplay stuff for Sputancon, Sputacon, whatever you want to call it. The one that's happening here in September. Like the first week of September. The first, actually. So, recently got my ticket, like, last night. Um, ticket prices, like, go up to Sunday and stuff. Today being Friday. Mm, well, yesterday I got it technically on Thursday. But anyways. So, um, I was able to get Delic actually pretty well done today, which was really lucky. Um, so, <coughs> sorry. Um, I took a trip down to the Goodwill today and uh, found all of this. Um, I guess the only thing I'm missing for Delic is the eye contacts and also his headphones and uh, his record player thing, but I'll be making that maybe last, I don't know. That all depends on what cosplay stuff is like a priority. This one was kind of a main priority because I didn't know where I was going to be able to find any of this stuff. Mostly the, the suit part itself, which it actually has padded shoulders, so that's a pretty rare find, maybe, I don't know. Uh, this thing actually only cost me 25, close to 26 bucks. It, not, not a bad find. Um, now I just need to learn how to tie a tie. I don't know how to do that. Um, but um, I got a friend that knows how to, or Possibly my dad might be able to help, but hey, on my account, Shizuo doesn't know how to tie a tie either because usually his brother did that for him, and or that was the bow tie. But still and yet, still something with ties. <laughs> so I'll figure that out. If um, not, I'll attempt to learn to tie it and stuff just so I don't have to rely on people to tie my tie so it won't look weird. Um, but yeah, so... He's all taken care of, mostly, besides the contacts. Um, I know I need to do a little bit, bit of detangling and stuff with this wig I've currently got on, because at the end of Phoenix Comic Con, um, like, just little strands of hair is just, like, all over the place, and I can notice them. I think one of the Isaiahs noticed it, too, because they, like, pulled a strand down. I was like, Ugh. So, sorry about that. <laughs> um, so I'll fix that and everything. So, um, other updates as far as everything else. Um, when it comes to Dorara, Dorara, Doraria, mm, um, I'm also going to be cosplaying as Red Fur Isaiah. Um, don't know if there's really a name for him besides just what I've been calling him. Like, Delic has his own name and Psyche, and yeah. I'll attempt to maybe make up a nickname for him, if not, if he doesn't have a name. But anyways, just so I can stop calling him Red Fur Isaiah. Anyway, um, so I need to get myself another jacket and actually get on with, um, sewing Connor's jacket because I actually got the fur. Give me one second and I'll go get that. So, this is the fur that I wanted up getting for the jacket. Um, I mostly got this one instead of a solid red because I thought it would add some decent accents to it. Because, like, once it's kind of folded, you'll see more red than black. It'll look better once it's done, I promise. That's the fur I ended up getting. Shit. Maybe I shouldn't get that close to this. <laughs> so, I just need to sit my butt down and actually just sew that jacket, because I do have it. Um, and I need to get myself another one. Um, so, off of the spectrum of Dorara. Hey, I said it right for once. whoop de do. Um... On the other ends of things, um, since recently we kind of are forming like a Dorara group cosplay thing, um, I don't know how it's going to go for Felsans because I did also plan on um, getting him together, which I still am continuing to do. Um, I just don't know what days uh, I'll be able to cosplay Felsans because that all depends on what Fel Frisk wants to do slash normal frisk, um, but I'm still going to be making him, um, the only complications with that is I haven't really worked with normal fabric and sewing it before, because fur is, I'm used to sewing fur on since you guys seen my, uh, sans jacket and all, with just the fur on the hood, but yeah, um, probably fell sans jacket's going to be the most, uh, complicated thing to do or time to be taken up. <sighs> I've got everything I need for him, it's just 
the initial of sitting down and sewing. You know, I'm lazy and, uh, yeah. <laughs> um, let me see. I wanted up getting um, a few other things from Goodwill today, besides just this stuff. Um, I wanted up getting a actual red scarf for when I cosplay normal sands again, so I won't actually have like a ripped up piece of fabric just around my neck, because I think the other one just got lost or completely shredded in the washer because I have not been able to find it recently. Um, other than that, with either fell or flower fell, um, I think he wears like a long sleeve turtleneck. I got that today. I'm gonna be dying in the freaking heat, even though it's gonna be September. I'm actually really warm right now, just wearing a two-piece long thing. But yeah, got that, and also another pair of shorts that I need to put the yellow stripe on. But other than that, I'm actually, like, really getting used to wearing shorts. They're really comfortable. I can see kind of why Sans wears them. Besides, well, they're comfortable, actually, so who knew? I usually don't wear shorts. So, away from cosplay updates, um, just stuff that randomly kind of got myself into this month of July of, um, stuff is last, well, literally yesterday was Thursday, um, at Barnes & Noble getting manga and stuff, just slash looking at it, and, um, person that, that works there, of course, um, let me know of an event that they're going on of, like, pop culture or something, and randomly on the 29th of this month, hey, if you do cosplay stuff, why don't you come in and stuff? And I'll be like, huh, okay, cool. So, besides my beanie that says senpai on it that you guys saw maybe once or twice, usually that gets me in trouble a lot. Oh, but anyways, back on track. Um, just standing by manga got me in trouble on getting myself invited to an event. <laughs> so, I've maybe gonna try and finish up Delic, um, his prop at least, and maybe cosplay Delic up to my local Barnes Noble, or if not, if I can't, like, get his record thingy bobber together, um, then I'll probably just dress up as normal she as well, um, and I'll kind of play it by ear if I could bring my sign or not. I still haven't had it debut anywhere at a freaking con, um, so... It might debut at Barnes & Noble. Whoops. <laughs> um, I would first make sure that people are actually cosplaying before I, like, put my wig on and walk in there and be like, oh, no one's dressed up, shit. So, I'll play that by ear. And, um, yeah. Other than that, 4th of July passed by recently. Hope everyone had a great 4th of July and didn't do anything stupid or stayed safe, or hope they did stay safe, my bad. <laughs> um, mine was pretty uneventful, ate over at a uh, relative's house, and had two distant cousins, yeah, distant cousins, um, like, flock to me and just talk about anime and randomly watched videos for like two hours straight. We were really noisy as hell, but other than that, um, I walked around the neighborhood myself and saw some fireworks. Um, I was kind of sitting to the side, and people were setting off their own fireworks, and um, a eventful evening that was. Um, I don't know if they're called mortars or not, but they're the big fireworks that launch into the air and, you know, the classic fireworks. Yeah, somebody lit three of them, and they went off on the ground. Some of them were kind of close up to me. I'm like, okay, time to go. But yeah, that was eventful. Watched fireworks go off. I don't know, it was something to do. So, anyways, hope everyone had a safe 4th of July, and yeah. Other than that, um, that pretty much does it for this long overdue update video. Sorry if it's really long, I don't know as of yet. Probably is because I ramble a lot. So, I'll end it here. So, other than that guys, see you later.